welcome back to my channel welcome back to a brand new video i hope you're all doing really really well today i have a haul cleaning home bargain type discount haul for you guys today let me pop this coffee down and just show you this is just one of the two boxes i have from cherries so cherries is an online discount store homeware discount bargain type store that you can shop via their app i will leave a direct link in the description box for you to click through to the app and they also have very kindly given me a discount code which is freya20 for you guys so make sure to take advantage of that discount code let me know what you guys purchase yourselves and of course a big thank you to cherries for very kindly working with me on today's video so they did actually send me a few bits a while ago which i shared on my instagram stories and i have actually highlighted it so if you want to see a previous haul from them i will leave my instagram account down below i have pulled out a few bits that i did get from that haul that i want to show you guys on youtube so i'm going to start with them before unboxing two massive boxes of new bits that i very kind of got sent from them the first couple of bits are some new kitchen utensils and i did pick up this three pack of white spoons let's face it all my interior decor and everything is predominantly white and I just thought these would be a nice addition to add to our cooking utensils drawer. Most things are one to two pounds, that sort of price point. There are some bits that are cheaper as well. In addition to the white spoons, I also picked up some white spatulas. This is a five pack of different sizes. And again, the fact that they're white is just aesthetically pleasing for me they do have the little holes here as well if you do have any like hooks that you like to kind of have your utensils on display i personally just put them in the drawer i also picked up a new can opener which we needed this one is black but they, i think they had a gray one as well and then i also picked up a new peeler because the one that we have is copper which i don't really have any copper in my house anymore and it's also like breaking it was a really cheap one that i got so long ago so we've got this brand new stainless steel one it's still got the little blue plastic cover on and stuff are just so good so this is in the scent spring my favorite was the lavish one but i think they changed that packaging didn't they mm, love that i've actually got some more of these i think i picked up some more and i also picked up another plug-in for the air wick which i actually have on there that's run out so i'm going to use this one as soon as i finish this video and plug it in there this one is in the scent linen in the air which has hints of green apple crisp linen and fresh air lasts up to 80 days love two little yankee candle votives in the scent mahogany and cedar and autumn glow because tis the season we are approaching autumn and i love this the fact that it's obviously white <laughs> but also for me fur kind of scents are some of my favorites so yeah cute i never know how to burn votives though so if you've got any tips or suggestions on how i could burn these maybe like a little glass tea light holder or something i don't know let me know how you burn your votives they've got some useful handy tips on here just to let you know that the app if you do shop by the app they have like reward schemes where you can earn points to get free products you also have refer a friend and there's things like the um added bonus of the delivery pass on the app as well so i would recommend you shop via the app the delivery pass is a subscription 12 pounds a year that you can sign up to with a 30-day free trial cancel any time and it basically allows you free standard delivery on all your orders over 20 pounds <gasps> I see Minky. Why do cleaning products make me so excited? This is Mrs. Hinge that I have to thank for this. Okay, so we've got some grill and pan scrubbing pads in gray and white. I also picked up some cleaning cloths. The, I've never tried these Minky cleaning cloths before, so excited to give them a try. And then I also stocked up on some of the oh, Minky cloths that are for the kitchen. I have the glass one and love it. So I'm excited to try the kitchen one. Let me see what else I got. So I got one, two, I think I got three of these. Three kitchen ones. And then I also got three of just the general purpose ones as well. If you have kids, they have loads of different toys and summer outdoor accessories, things like that as well. Um, I obviously don't. So I've got a lot of home decor and home cleaning products in this haul. And this is another little handy contraption for our kitchen. This is one of those 
um, vegetable choppers, again in white. I also picked up a loaf tin. I don't know if it's in this box, it must be in the other box, but I've also got some loaf tin liners as well. Just really handy to have for baking banana bread, which is one of my favorite recipes. I also got some cotton balls. This is a pack of 100 to keep for when I need to stock up my little glass jar in our bathroom oh yeah i forgot i got this so this is really handy i thought this is a microwave safe plate cover so this is actually a pack of two and it just allows you to put your full size plate of dinner in to reheat to be able to just pop a cover over it because tom's got into this habit of putting something in the microwave without a cover and it spits all over it, which means having to clean the microwave more often, which is not ideal. So I'm gonna show him these so that he is aware that they exist and hopefully, fingers crossed, he'll use them. I love these. This is from the Vintage Collection. This is an oval planter, outdoor, indoor, however you wanna use it. They also had this. I think they had these in gray as well, actually, but I went for the kind of cream version. So we've got this flower pot here, flower planter, this oval planter, this cute little mini bucket planter, and last but not least from this collection, I have this, which was the main thing that I liked, to be completely honest with you. It's a little tin of twine, which I think is so handy, so practical as well to have it stored away in a tin like this. And it's just got a little piece of thread here that you can just pull through chop as and when you need and in there is the roll of twine. I also picked up these three set of terracotta planters which come with a little chalk set that you can write on the different herbs that you're planting, sort of starter pots that as and when you need to like sow seeds. <laughs> I am not a gardener, I don't know if I'm using the right terminology or not, but I thought these were cute. I feel like they're very much Lydia Millen inspired. If anyone else watches her vlogs, you'll know what I mean. She has her little sprutlings, which she plants. Oh, they're quite big actually. Look, that's the full size of them and that's the chalk there that you write on. Okay, the last thing in this first box, which I can now put over there, are some faves. I've stocked up on trusty Flora. I actually went for a few different scents. So I've got Country Garden. I also got Lavender and Lavender Escape. I'm not sure which is my favorite of the two, maybe Lavender. And then I also got Linen Fresh, which is good for the bedroom. And then Midnight Blooms, which is the dupe for, which one is it? It's not Black Opium. Alien perfume, maybe? Right, so let's get the second box open. Oh, we're in. This box is even bigger. I plaited my hair last night and just kind of left it till the morning. So it's wavy, but not my traditional curls. What do you think? It's quite handy, really, because then that means no heat, which is obviously better for your hair. Oh, I thought there was a spider. <laughs> oh, in fact, I forgot to show you from my last haul. I'll show you this one. But I picked up an outdoor um, melamine type salad bowl. So I also got this to match it. It's a plate. I did nearly think about picking up a set of these, but I don't need a set because I have some from Poundland, which I love. So I thought this could be more of like a display plate for like hors d'oeuvres or nibbles for outside. And I think they had glassware as well. Well, not glassware, melamine cups. What's this? So not only do they do household items, cleaning products, they also do food and drink. <gasps> so I picked up two spreads in the M&M's crispy pieces, which this chocolate bar that they do in this flavor is my absolute fave. And then I also picked up a Maltesers one. So I thought we could get fun with some creative baking maybe. I just couldn't resist. <laughs> okay, okay. To go with my coffee, which let me just take a little sip, I also got some biscuits. Oh, it's cooled down a bit now. I actually like my coffee piping hot. A bit weird like that. A lot of people like to let it cool. I don't, I like it hot. <coughs> Bless me. 
always sneezing tubes. Okay, so I picked up some toilet roll which we needed and these were interesting because they are scented lemon fresh. I also picked up this one which is in lavender. We've stopped up for a while now, soon as though it's just me and Tom that live together. Another kitchen accessory that I wanted to pick up, we use these all the time, so just super handy, so I picked up another one. These are like a black plastic serving spoon. And then I also did pick up one of these, but I left it at my mum's house um, for her to have when I did my haul on Instagram stories. And it's a cute little flower shaker, cocoa duster shaker. Now I do already have a stainless steel one that I keep cocoa powder in. So for that, that's more for just on top of coffees. But this I thought would be handy just to have a spare and have an empty one for if I'm baking or whatever and I need a flour or an icing sugar duster to decorate cakes with or whatever. And it's white, yet again. These are the loaf tins that I, no not loaf tins, loaf tin liners that I mentioned I picked up for the loaf tin. And I also picked up some muffin cases, just plain white, yet again, nice and simple. You get 125 cases in here. This excites me more than it probably should, but I now have my very own Mrs. Hinch pen. She's obviously a silver lover, I prefer golds. So they had this pen, I think, in rose gold, gold, and silver. I'm looking at it over there. I've got my activity journal and my Mr. Tinch little book of lists over there, which I use a rubbish cheap pen, like one of them free pens that you get from a hotel or something. But now I have my very own diamond gold pen. To go with this, I also got this. Oh, I thought this would be really handy to have, actually. Auto interiors wipes just to keep in your car. It's a pack of 40. And it's just to have them conveniently at hand because I find my dashboard gets quite dusty. <laughs> I also thought I would pick up this again to either keep in my car, keep in a handbag, wherever really just to have it handy. And it's one of these fold away shopping bags. So I'll always have a shopping bag on me because quite often I'll go in to get one thing and think I won't need to take a bag with me end up coming out with too much stuff to carry. Oh, this is another thing that I got uh, last time I ordered from them and left at my parents' house because when I'm there, I'll be able to have one. When I'm here, I'll now be able to have one. And it's the variety pack from Beanies. They do the cutest, well, I don't, I don't know if I can call it cute. That's not the best adjective. The yummiest, that's probably not a word, flavoured coffees, instant coffees, and this is a 12 pack of different flavours, so no added sugar, there are only two calories per cup, amaretto almond, double chocolate, Irish cream, nutty hazelnut, creamy caramel, very vanilla, chocolate orange, mini, no, mini chocolate, mint chocolate, cookie dough, yum, uh, cinnamon hazelnut, again cinnamon is one of my favourite flavours, coconut delight and gingerbread. I cannot wait for the Costa gingerbread lattes. Oh. oh, and I got some teas, I forgot about these. These are ginger and citrus fruit flavored Lloyd teas, little tea bags. You get 20 in a pack. I think this is the last of the food items. So they have loads of these um, snack stops, snack stop pasta type sachets. I rarely have these, but I always like to have them in, you know, just for on those days where I'm like, maybe it gets to an evening, I'm not that hungry, but I want something. These are just super handy to have, and they have such good shelf lives on them. These last until November next year. Always good to just have in. I got chicken and mushroom creamy cheese, but they had loads of different flavors. I did also get some face masks. I actually find these like blue medical ones easier to wear. I also got some storage boxes, reusable containers for like leftover, for leftovers and things like that. I also got a stock up of kitchen foil, wrap cling film and baking parchment paper. Oh, if you could see the mess in front of me right now. I got some new favorites of mine, some elbow grease products. I got three of these scrubbing pads because these are actually really good. They were fairly new and I tried one out and really got on with it. So I picked up three more of those. I've never tried these power cloths from Elba Grease before, but this is a seven pack. 
and it has these little scrubbing dots on it so it says it's good for removing tough and stubborn stains like on cookers it's non-scratch as well this is really good this is one of their scrub mates which goes like soft when wet hard when dry i always find it so hard to believe how these can be non-scratch but they are and then of course the trusty old fave the elbow grease all purpose degreaser i also got some new fabulosas i am as a flora girl i do really like it but fabulosa is another trusted brand that people seem to love so i got gold touch i also got sky intrigued to see what that smells like and tranquil haze i also got a fabric softener this is the one that we use the fairy in original 18 washers and yeah okay i thought i picked up some more of these some more lenore unstoppables in the scent spring i also picked up some more bin bags these are 20 packs each holding up to 50 liters and i'm having a bit of a clear out and i always find these really handy to section things off to charity bin keep and all that jazz i also got a vanish for our cleaning platinum crystal white cleaner that you pop in your wash there is a lone minky pad in there as well that i picked up but i do actually have a couple of spare of them already so i only just wanted to pick up the one and then i also saw these which are the removable hanging strips i thought these would be really handy to have i do have a couple of command ones left but not many so i picked up some more these are really handy especially if you're in rental accommodation i get a lot of questions on where this prints from actually this is from decenio if you type in beige paint or something like that that will come up another elbow grease product that i did actually pick up last time but left it with my mum and it is the glass cleaner with vinegar in it this is streak free uh, really handy to have and I was out of window cleaner. I use these on mirrors as well I've never tried this before but always been intrigued by it It is from finish and it's a dishwasher cleaner in the scent lemon So I think you pretty much use the whole bottle. Yes, you do in the dishwasher run it on empty on an 85 degrees wash You haven't done one of these in a while, which we haven't I'm going to try this one out. I kind of wish I'd picked up more of these actually, but I only got the one pack. This is a 12 pack of cedarwood mothballs. Um, I do have the little cedar blocks that I got from Ikea in Tom's wardrobe. So I'm going to pop these ones in mine. They're just meant to deter moths and help it keep it, you know, fresh. I also picked up some Lenore in Gold Orchid. No, it's not. It's in Summer Breeze. These are tumbled. Oh my God, I can smell them already tumble dryer sheet so even though we don't have a tumble dryer in this house i like to use these to insert into cushions pillows whatever as you sit down it puffs out a smell of this along with the vanish powder i also picked up this color control mega whites to help your keep help help keep your whites white this is a 12 pack and yeah i'll give these a try as well especially with bed sheets and towels i find they go a bit dull and then i also picked up this from astonish this is power clean toilet bowl tabs i've never used these before they blast lime scale calcium and rust you just drop in one tab leave it for 20 minutes no scrubbing required it is a pack of 10 i also picked up some new fairy in this scent which is tea tree and mint i thought that sounded nice and fresh and lovely and again i know i'm a bit crazy when it comes to having everything white but i don't know i just like the fact that i don't think we have them in white in our country do we they're always clear so if you get a really nice scent but it's blue like i have got one that is blue that i'm currently using but it's blue this is white the last and final item if you stuck with me this long you deserve a pat on your back i picked up some more of the airwick i picked up some more of the airwick scents these plugins again i've got one in this room two in the others but i also needed one more plug so i did pick up the full set in mum's baking oh, yum it's in baked pear pie crust and vanilla let me do a little scratch and sniff Ooh, that's nice see i wouldn't say yeah maybe it's the baked pear i wouldn't say that that is that sweet even though it's baking it's more spicy i like that 
like kind of cinnamony. Oh yeah, you can even see like an apple pie on there. Oh, yum. And then I did get three plugins. I got two of Forest Waters, which sounds amazing. And then this one, which I'm a bit delayed with because it's first day of spring, but I might actually get this one used up now whilst it is still towards, you know, the end of summer. But Forest Waters, how nice does that sound? There's no scratch and sniff on it, but it's got hints of blackberry, dewy leaves and wild rosemary. Mm, nice. This one is cut grass, apple blossom and daffodil. So that completes this haul from Cherries. I hope you liked it. Something new, something different. Let me know if you shop anything yourself. Don't forget to take advantage of that discount code FREYA20 if you shop via the link in my description box where it will open up the app. If you shop via the app, use that discount code. Start gaining from the benefits as well that the app has on offer in terms of free products and point systems. Thank you so, so much for watching and I hope to see you all very soon in my next video. Bye guys!